This is the next video about the light dependent switch. And now I have reversed the contacts in the 741 op amp. And uh, here you can see how that was made. This is the schematic. I didn't use a resistor here, but you can see that um, on pin 2 we now have the reference voltage. And on pin 3 we have a varying voltage and that depends completely on the resistance from the LDR, the light dependent resistor. So in light it's 50, 50 ohms and in dark it's 500 kilo ohms or more. So that gives a very substantial voltage change on this pin, pin 3. And that means that the LED switch is on when it is dark. I want to demonstrate it now. Here you see the potentiometer from 10K. It's here. Here the light dependent resistor. Clear to see. Always interesting to see how such a resistor looks like. I hope we can make it more visible. And um, at the output, again, our LED light emitting diode. So I switch off the light now. And you can see that the LED lights up when the light is switched off. Now the LED doesn't light up. So. In fact, it is the reversed circuit from the circuit published in my book. This book, Schematics 3. And um, it's very easy to uh, make an op amp to work like this. So you can do all kinds of experiments. For instance, when I connected a capacitor here in the circuit, uh, it proves that the light, that the LED lights up for a longer time, because the capacitor holds charge and it takes time to make the charge flow away through the op amp. So these are all very funny and interesting applications from such a very simple circuit that you can use in all kinds of ways.